For many, living on the lake is a dream, but the drought is causing lake levels to drop at Lake Corpus Christi. Our Andrew Christensen was out on the lake and he spoke with property owners about their experience with the drought. Andrew. Well, I want you to imagine this entire area filled up with water. That's what residents tell me Lake Corpus Christi was like about a year ago. Now, as you can tell, it's just filled up with this mud and dirt. Now, one resident that I spoke with tells me that it's gotten so bad that he's had to walk about half a mile to this area that I'm going to show you right over here just to go boating. For Jim Costlo, the lake's been going down one to two inches every day. Monitoring Lake Corpus Christi's water levels is a daily routine. He's an avid fisherman. Even a walking catfish can't live here. And boater. We bought a new pontoon boat, but it won't run on mud. And says Lake Corpus Christi was five feet deep in April and falling. Actually, this pier is when the lake's full, it's completely level. You can walk straight out. With no water, Coslo is having to use an excavator to keep the channel clean. Just down the street, the water used to come up here right to the property. And Billy Moorfield misses when the lake would come up to his backyard. He says some years droughts are worse than others. If we don't get any rain by September, it's going to be uh, one of the worst. But the drought, not drying up Coslo and Moorfield's hopes that one day the lake will be back to normal. I'm hoping it'll rain so we'll get some lake. Everybody needs it, you know, <laughs> not just lake owners. Now this summer isn't as busy as in years past. Moorfield tells me that usually around this time of the year, he'd see boaters and skiers enjoying the water behind his home. But he tells me that this year, there's not as many. Reporting in Lake City, Andrew Christensen, Chris 6 News.